talk about Kyle Shanahan. I was not impressed by Kyle Shanahan in this game. What the hell was that? I'm sorry. What was creative about what he did today? Usually there's a few plays in his game plan where you're like, man, I've never seen that before. Or that was just brilliant. Or, man, that got that guy wide open. The best thing he did today, I think, was in the red zone when he used George Kittle as a decoy that one time to get Jawan Jennings wide open. That was nice. That was really smart. Everyone's going to look at Kittle, so let's use him to draw three defenders and get Jawan Jennings open. Other than that, what, what was effective about what Kyle Shanahan did on offense? The run game was like Jimmy Ray. Like, let's just run the ball into a brick wall over and over and over again and average three yards a carry. Now, I mean, it was effective because the Eagles were just tripping all over themselves, but and the defense was so good, and the special teams was making plays, but like, what the hell was that run game? You're supposed to be the best run game coordinator in the league, and you couldn't. First of all, why why does Elijah Mitchell get all the carries? It seems like Trey Sermon was very explosive on that one carry before he got concussed. And Jermichael ha Hasty, I mean, he fumbled, true, <laughs> but uh, they recovered, and he was extremely explosive. I don't know. I I just didn't see anything from. Kyle Shanahan this week that made me feel like he was particularly inspired. Like you just called a million screens and scored 17 points. You're going to take credit. I wouldn't call that complimentary offense. I would just call that bad offense and really good special teams and defense. I don't understand why we're praising that offensive performance. It's great that the Niners won and he's the head coach. He gets credit for, you know, overseeing a win. But what about the offensive coordinator, Kyle Shanahan? That offense was awful. No run game. No creativity. Kittle's gone. Ayuk is in the doghouse. All you have is Debo Samuel, and you won't play Trey Lance. Now, I understand you won the game, but, like, how could he have hurt your offense? It was awful. Can he not hand off? He can't hand off. He can't throw screens? I just feel like bringing him in would have given the, 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 the Eagles defense something else to, to worry about. And now you would have had an offense that was going from terrible output to like maybe mediocre. I don't know. So I, everyone's going to praise Kyle Shanahan. But honestly, if we if he were the coordinator and you were just praising his job as a coordinator, it'd be a D. 17 points? With a defense that was ha handling the game for you. I don't know. I guess I hold Kyle Shanahan to higher. I just think he's so good that I think he should be able to do better than that. There was not one play in this game from the Niners where I was like, well, that was really nice. That was a really clever design, or that was a perfect play call for that situation. Like, D'Amico Ryans was by far the best coach of the Niners today. And, and this not playing Trey Lance just seems stubborn at this point. You don't need a spark. The offense didn't get anything going until, like, 30 seconds left in the first half, and they finished with 17 points. I don't know. That's the best you could do, Kyle? Yeah, I'm calling you out. Is that the best you can do, Kyle? That is not a Super Bowl offense. That's not a playoff offense. You, what you basically did was kneel down today and let the defense win the game, let the Eagles lose it. I don't know. I'm not impressed. But I do hold you to a high standard. I think you're an excellent coach, Kyle. I think you could do better than that. I think you could. Am Todd says, I think a solid defensive game outweighs our offensive struggles. Guess how we fix our offense? It rhymes with Bay. Stop being negative, Iggy. That's the thing about the Niners. They have this really slow, plotting, tedious offense, but they have the potential to be so much more dangerous. And Kyle's just in the way. I love, I mean, Trey Lance couldn't have done that today. Trey Lance couldn't have scored 17 points. Would he really have lost this game? I don't know. What it, what it, everyone's like, well, they won. So what's the point? Lance couldn't have won this game. What is this doing for the future? Is Jimmy Garoppolo going to be this quarterback here next year? Is that what's going to happen? Franklin says, hey, just curious. How do you think the refs have been so far? I would give them a B plus. No one's perfect. You know, they're human too. Sacramento Mike says big difference between last year and this year. Defense, we bend, but don't break. We allow yards, but not TVs. Offense, same as last year. We can't run. Offense, same as last year, can't run or pass. Yeah. Good defense, though. Uh, Nick Bosa, Fred Warner, 
Jaquaski Tart, Jimmy Ward. Clutch performances by these guys. Good defense. We were questioning them. They responded. Route Runner 49er says, unpopular opinion. This team is going to have a harder time as the season progresses. Wow, we look mediocre. Where was Kyle's mind today? Yeah, man. I mean, that, that they really had to take it down to the wire against the Eagles and the Lions. Now, I like the Eagles and think they'll probably win eight, nine games this year, but what? It's good to good to win, good to survive. Win's a win, but what? Is this team going to beat Seattle? Is this team going to beat Arizona? I don't know. I feel you, route runner. Keldon says Lance will sit like Lahomes did. Relax. I don't have to relax. Don't tell me to relax. I'm the opposite of relaxed. I'm not relaxed at all. 